guys, welcome back to my channel and to another episode of Flute Life with Katie Flute. So today I have some piccolos to share with you, but please let the record show that I am not claiming to be a piccolo guru at all, so please don't judge my playing too harshly. But I've been getting some comments here about piccolos and I've gotten a lot of DMs of people asking me which piccolo is right for them. Um, so I thought that I would finally give you guys some more piccolo content, whether you're ready or not. But nevertheless, I am excited to share with you guys three great options of piccolos for a student flutist who's just starting out on piccolo. All three of the piccolos that I'm going to show you come from the Flute Center of New York, and by now, if you are not new to my channel, you know that I love the Flute Center. The Flute Center is a huge store here in New York City, but they also ship worldwide. You can try all three of these piccolos yourself by setting up a free trial at the Flute Center, and if you use my code KTFL, you'll get free shipping, an extended trial period, which means that you can keep these three piccolos for up to 10 days to try instead of the normal seven. And if you do decide to purchase anything when you're done, my code will give you an 18 month extended warranty. My code will also give you 10% off all flute sheet music. Okay, so without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> So first I'm going to introduce each piccolo to you and then I will play some excerpts on them back to back so you can compare them. All three of these piccolos are student level piccolos and they fall into the lower end of the price range as far as piccolos are concerned. So first up we have this Gemeinhart 1P piccolo. It has a sterling silver plated head joint, a plastic body, and sterling silver plated keys. I feel like I played on this exact model of piccolo during my short-lived high school marching band career, so it's super basic, but it gets the job done. Piccolo number two is also a Gemeinhart piccolo. This is model 4P. This piccolo is like the previous Gemeinhart piccolo, but the head joint is also made of plastic. And finally, piccolo number three is a Dijau piccolo, and it's model 102. It has a composite bubble style head joint with a profiled lip plate and wave embouchure, a composite body, silver plated keys, and the split E mechanism. This piccolo is definitely the fancier of the three and the composite material that it's made out of is basically plastic mixed with grenadilla wood.
So there you have it. Those are three great beginner piccolo options. Thank you guys for watching and once again a big thank you to the Flute Center of New York for making this video possible. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any future content from me. Thanks again for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Thank you.